Hi, my name is Dr. Brian Kelly, and I'm the Chief of the Sports Medicine Department here at the Hospital for Special Surgery. And I'm going to talk a little bit about a research project that myself and our research team here, and in collaboration with Dr. Ashish Betty at University of Michigan, performed. We were looking at the characteristics and outcomes of arthroscopic FAI surgery on athletes who uh, competed in the NFL. With an increasing recognition of these types of injuries in the NFL and an increasing number of patients who are injured with labral pathology with underlying hip impingement, we were interested in identifying what the outcomes of these patients were and how they were treated. So over the course of an eight-year period between 2006 and 2014, we were able to look at 48 hips in, in 40 athletes and look at their return to play status and what their outcomes were after these surgeries. Uh, this was an interesting study because when we compared this to the earlier studies looking at NFL injury surveillance data, trying to identify hip injuries in the NFL, there was a significantly lower percentage of uh, hip injuries identified. So we believe that an increasing understanding of this pathology and better treatment options has led to an increased number of patients that are being treated for this pathology. The findings were that there was a very high rate of return in these athletes after arthroscopic FAI surgery and was much higher than what had previously been reported in the orthopedic literature. Uh, we showed faster return to play time, uh, approximately six months compared to those reported for other procedures. And I think these have important implications for counseling elite athletes, uh, particularly NFL players, in, in, with regard to their return to play and how to manage these injuries. We have a lot of uh, additional studies that we need to do to look into this more carefully. Uh, specifically, we're interested in re-evaluating the NFL injury surveillance data to see if there's an increasing number compared to the original study performed back in the early 2000s uh, in, in identifying hip pathology in these athletes.